Sixty-two. Sixty-two. Yes, sixty-two. The crew. The uh, crew. Um, three. Uh, we have uh, five crew. In total. Five crew. Yeah. Okay. Cabin crew. Sixty-two. Yeah, sixty-two plus five. Yeah. Sixty-two, 62 plus, plus five. five. Yeah, sixty-two plus five. So, uh, no casualty. No, no casualty. No casualty. Everyone was fine, and um, the passengers were calm, and they were actually grateful to um, God because um, we delayed the flight out of Port Harcourt because Port Harcourt was reporting that the visibility was reducing. So we delayed the uh, departure out of uh, Lagos to make sure that the weather subsided. But regardless, I felt like uh, on us coming in, um, the uh, the runway was still wet and slippery to the uh, initial report we have was the aircraft landed and uh, it was trying to maneuver and uh, it uh, had a runway a caution we went off the runway so uh, the uh, investigators from the Nigerian safety investigation bureau are uh, there you know started the investigation to give us the full details of what actually happened. And uh, of course, they will conduct their extensive, normal extensive investigation as to why or what might have caused the uh, incident. Uh, no substantial damage to the aircraft and uh, all the passengers are safe. As the regulator to the Nigerian Civil Aviation Authority, we have already heightened uh, surveillance to ensure that uh, uh, these incidents don't happen. And nobody really knows what uh, caused the three incidents. But I just want to reassure the traveling public we are doing what we need to do to ensure that the safety we've had with the scheduled passenger flights over the last 10 years is maintained. We don't have any major accidents with any loss of life.